uh, today I'm going to be talking about an electronic screwdriver, the ES121. You can use a micro USB at this end to charge it. You can even charge it off of your computer. As you can see here, you got the battery status, how much battery life is left in it. And when it's plugged in, you get that lightning bolt icon in here for when it's plugged in to be charged. And as you can see here, you got the screw. If you hold it in, turn it one way, you can see it's being screwed in. And it's motion sensitive. You turn it the other way, you can see it being unscrewed. If you tap it three times, you can see it can use different programs. As you can see, each time I push the button, and once you release it, it'll go back to there. Now, this is for micro precision screws. You cannot use something like this. It just won't fit. What you do is use one of these, which has got the wings at the end to make sure when you secure it in here, it will hold in place. This one happens to be a Phillips screwdriver. Now in here, you got like five more of them. One of them is a flat tip, which can be used and you, you, you can see here turning and uh, when you go to unscrew something and you press the button to unscrew it if it's too tight what you want to do is try to manually unscrew it manually unscrew it this way probably a half a turn a quarter of a turn just to get it going if you won't and here you can see the screw came out now it's also magnetic where you can plug it in it oh, place it in there first to screw it back in now some of these are going to be plastic where the screw goes into you want to make sure you don't over tighten it where you will break the plastic where it goes into this happens to be a digital camera As you can see, it's very easy to unscrew. Let's see. Well, it's too small for me to hold it up by hand. So let me put it on here one more time. As you can see, it's magnetic, so it won't fall off. Like I said before, you make sure you turn this in such a way where you can see it. Like I said, you can feel it when it reaches the end of being screwed in. You don't want to overdo it. And look, if this battery status gets too low, you as usual, you would know to charge it using a micro USB. And you can use whatever the programs that's on here by pressing this three times. As you can see, 
and you press it, bring it down to the section you want. For me, I leave it at A, unless I come across something that requires the other four. And they're pretty expensive. I purchased this one here for $95 off of Amazon. Now you can probably get them off of eBay or something. But if you're working with uh, position screws, which require something like this, or if you're working in jewelry with tiny screws, this will come in handy. Or, or if you're working on hobbies, which requires small screws, this would also come in handy for that too. Well, I hope this was beneficial to you and enjoy using one if you decide to buy one. All right, have a nice evening. Goodbye.